gents, how is everybody doing? Hope you're doing fine and outstanding while you're uh, taking time to watch this video. So this is Junior with SOT Metalworks coming at you with another sign. I know, I know, it's not the dirt perfect stuff. We're laying off it for just a minute, trying to get a few things uh, squared away. But it's all right. We're going to get back in it. We're going to get it posted here just before too much longer. Uh, so, that being said, we're going to have another sign night tonight. We're going to cut this fine and dandy looking peacock and let me tell you it's got some uh, challenges to it so all right so we've already got it all drawn up we've got our lead ins and lead outs there as you can see uh, each one of these parts is going to fix and or fixing to get cut out here and this is going to be in the metallic finish however this is going to they're all going to be one of a kind uh, when I paint these there is not one that's going to match the other, I can guarantee you, because it's going to be hand sprayed. Uh, it was a little challenging and a little hard, but we did get her done, and it, one of them turned out fantastic. I'm fixing so paint on the other one, and we'll see how it turns out. So, as long as it goes as good as the first one, we'll be all right. So, without further ado, let's jump over here to the table and see just exactly what we got going on. Get this in route program working. Cut her out on our my fine and dandy shop saber cnc plasma table see just what kind of product we can turn out and i can tell you right now it turned out fantastic but you guys are going to stick around to see that all right let's get after it everybody
All right, so you guys just seen the peacock getting cut out. Hopefully it come out just fine on the video. But yeah, there's a lot of lead ins and lead outs on this one. A lot of small parts. And we actually just went ahead and cut two just to see. So yeah, customer order. Hopefully they're going to like it. This is actually family members. So uh, I got to get this one pretty squared away, which I do for everybody. But well, let's see how it turns out. We're going to get her over here on the table, get a little... Uh, a little grinding done on it, get everything kind of cleaned up, get her outside, do a little etching solution on it, and then we're going to see just how wild we can get with these colors. And I don't know, this could be, uh, could be a little crazy, not sure. guys we got the uh, peacocks out here it is windy as i'll get out out here i mean this has been like the windiest spring ever but got the magical solution get the mill scale off of here we're gonna get our designs or to get these in the garage get them all cleaned up get our designs in here get this wonderful paint on there so we had a customer order one guys with some of these more difficult designs while i'm cutting if they're not personalized with their name in them stuff, sometimes I'll go ahead, and this is just a tip, I'll go ahead and get two cut out. So that way I've got one to showcase or, you know, for sale or whatever it may be. So it, uh, it always pays sometimes on these more difficult designs to go ahead and get an extra cut out sometimes. You save yourself time, money, effort, the whole nine yards. So... All right, let's get them finished up. We'll get them in here and get some cleaning done on them. See what happens. Well, all right. So I've just painted one of the peacocks and I think it turned out pretty, pretty good. I didn't know they had that much blue on them, but they do have a lot of blue. Rolls right into the green tail feathers. I wish the light would do it a little justice, but. Woo wee What a bird. That ought to look special being on somebody's wall. So, the other good reason about uh, doing two signs is uh, if you happen to mess one up and, and not do it exactly right, you got, uh, you got a backup over there. So, I like how this one turned out. Really, really loving it. Hard to get all the edges though. This is definitely not a sign you want to hang outside because I'm not exactly sure if I got every single edge on that thing. But this mild steel is uh, pretty good for the inside of the house. So no big deal there. But yeah. All right, ladies and gents, there you go. That is the peacock. Uh, lights in here are not doing it justice whatsoever. Got some, uh, the wife got some pretty good pictures of this thing out in the sun a while ago. And, uh, man, it was just gleaming off this thing. It was just, it was wild. Wish, wish I took a little more time, got a little better pictures. But, yeah, can't, uh, can't say enough good things about this one. It, uh, it really shows up good. And, uh, wish you guys could see it in person. And you can, you can. And I'll tell you just how you can do that. All right, to see this peacock in person, it's very easy to do. You go to sotmetalworks.com, you order it online, you get it shipped to your house, and then you can see just how awesome looking it is. But, uh, nah, sorry, Ch shameless plug there. But uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we should be getting this on the website here before too long, so we'll have it so you guys can take a look at it. Hopefully we'll get a few better pictures, uh, a little better little better view of how it pops. I think the wife's got a couple pictures. She may post them on social media. Uh, it's got me holding it, standing in the sun, the sun gleaming off of it. It really does. It really looks awesome. So we're going to get back over here and paint this other one, 
Guys, tremendous amount of viewers here lately. Can't thank you guys enough. A lot of you guys come from Dirt Perfect. Appreciate that man for his shout out for SOT Metalworks. Couldn't thank him enough for that one. Got us over 2,000 subscribers. So it's been a long, hard fight, but that's all right. We're, we're just chugging right along. Don't mind it at all. So we're going to cut out on, it, on out of here if I can learn how to speak. You guys be safe out there. Go over and check out SOT Metalworks. Give us a like, hit the thumbs up, ring that bell, do all the fine and dandy stuff you guys are so good at doing. And as I always say, remember, work smarter, not harder. We're out, guys. Y'all be good.